हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट द न्यू पोएम फ्रॉम आवर सी बी एस सी एट स्टैंडर्ड एंड सी ई आर टी टेक्स्ट बुक द नेम ऑफ द पोएम इज द जोग्रफी लेसन ना यू विल वंडर व्हाट इज दिस जोग्रफी लेसन बट इट इज़ अ पोएम सो इट इज़ अ लेसन दैट टीच इज अस अबाउट जोग्रफी Now, what about geography? Does it teach us? Let's see. Have you seen a jet plane? Jet plane. And uh, have you seen the view from a jet plane? How many of you have sat in a jet plane before? Can you see the view from the jet plane? You can see the entire geographic area of our city or whichever city you are flying flying from. you can see the sea you can see the land you can see the buildings but do they appear the same size do they appear of the same neatness or do you see walls formed or do you see buildings some small some tall some towers some seas or so small some seas big some land formations so this is what the poem talks about the geographical view from the airplane window from the jet window let me show you one such example Let's go back to our poem. Hmm. We are at the first paragraph. When the jet sprang into the sky, it was clear why the city had developed the way it had. So, when the jet sprang, when the jet sprang into the sky means when it started flying. when the jet sprang into the sky so you know airplanes they first have a certain road to first travel on the wheel and then they fly and they have a landing and they have a pick up so when the jet sprang as soon as it started flying in the sky it was clear why the city had developed the way it had seeing it scale 6 inches to the mile so now the fly, flight is 6 inches above the about the feet suppose you go 6 inches above the ground so 6 inches above the to the mile there seemed an inevitability see the word inevitability the meaning of the word is certain to happen it is unavoidable okay there seemed a unavoidable situation inevitability what do you think is the opposite of inevitability about what on ground had looked haphazard haphazard means full of confusion all gadbad gondad 
unplanned means nothing was planned it looks like this see in this over here does it look like everything is planned and made doesn't it look like it is haphazard something is big something is small some some sea is big some sea is small the roads are in a different route the cars look so tiny when the jet sprang into the sky so everything looks haphazard and planned so let me mark the difficult words for you the difficult marks uh, marked words are in red inevitable haphazard unplanned and without style when the jet sprang into the sky when the jet reached 10000 feet now your plane is flying higher a jet is peak flying higher it was clear why the country had cities where the rivers ran and why the valleys were populated so now when they are going more higher in the flight they are realizing why the country had cities where the rivers ran where where are the places where rivers are running and where why are the valley areas more populated you must have studied this in geography because of the water facilities they can grow crops they can wash clothes so valley areas are more populated some areas are just bare land so when it went 10000 feet high the logic of geography now they understand the logic of geography that land and water attracted man that it was land and water that attracted man land where farming could happen water where all the other facilities can be fulfilled was clear delineated now it was clearly understood when the jet reached 10000 feet when the jet rose 6 miles high now we are going 6 miles high 6 miles high it was clear the earth was round now when you are going a little more above than 10000 feet the earth is round and it had more sea than land so they realized that this had more sea than so coming back to the next page of the poem we were here when the jet rose 6 miles high it was clear that the earth was round and that it had more sea than land you could see more water more sea than land but it was difficult to understand that the men on the earth found causes to hate each other to build walls across cities and to kill from that height it was not clear why so when you are looking at a city from a height maybe you can try this go to a terrace today uh, i i won't suggest you to fly to some city or some country in this corona virus but you can go up to the terrace and you can see some part of the city and you will see you won't be able to see exactly the same view as from an airplane view but you can at least have a rough idea of what we are talking about in this poem so the poet zulfikar ghosh is talking about that it is clearly understood why there is more sea why there is less land why which area is more populated why which area is less populated why there are more people near the valley why there are more seas but it was not clear why men on the earth found causes to hate each other why did they find causes to hate each other to build walls across cities and to kill it's a very deep message is sending if the city looks so beautiful if the valley and the rivers and the population everything is understood why do they still fight why do they still have difference of opinion why do they still want to kill they want to have wars that he never understood so this is all the poem about and we shall see you next time